Hi there, students. A grimoire. A grimoire. Okay, this is a brilliant word. It's a book of magic spells. It's a book of invocations, okay? A grimoire, a book, a spell book, yeah? It's a textbook of magic. Teaches you how to create magic objects, how to create, how to perform magic spells, how to do divination, yeah, to see the future, how to summon um, some angels or spirits or demons. Um, yeah, how to make talismans or amulets, okay? So, it's a book of magic, yeah? Um, so, in the grimoire, you've got information about spells, rituals, lists of ingredients, um, the things that you, you need to do. Um, so, I think, effectively, you could consider almost... Um, all books on magic are grimoires, yeah? Um, okay, so a grimoire. It's uh, a book that belongs to a magician to tell you what to do. It's how uh, you could uh, le learn how to do um, magic spells, yeah? So how to uh, make somebody fall in love with you. Yeah, um, I think grimoires have been around from the beginning of history. Um, I think they've even found grimoires in um, in uh, cuneiform, in in Mesopotamian uh, tablets. Yeah, um, the ancient Egyptians used magical incantations. Yeah, um, I, I, the the Greeks and the Romans u used them. Yeah, so uh, a grimoire. A grimoire. It's a book of magic. It tells you what to do and uh, ha ha how to do it. Um, so a, a a grimoire. Yeah, is a, a book of witchcraft. A book of magic. Well, I think it could be good magic as well. So um, yeah, definitely a a grimoire. It's a textbook of sorcery and magic. Um, Let's see, I think uh, it's, if you go into a shop, there are all sorts of uh, books that uh, profess to be uh, grimoires, but, well, I, I don't think uh, uh, anybody would sell you the real thing. Or maybe, uh, that m maybe they've been published and just no nobody um, be believes that they're true. Yeah, um, I guess a grimoire could be a book of instructions for alchemy as well. Yeah, um, to change um, uh, lead or base things into into gold. Okay, so yeah, I would definitely love love to uh, ha have a uh, a grimoire. Um, I w uh, that, although I think maybe then you would uh, won wonder if it was true. I think over time there have been uh, various grimoires. The secret grimoire of Turiel, uh, written in the 16th century. Yeah, but, well, it uh, only dates to the 1920s. So, I think may uh, maybe a grimoire is going, a real grimoire is going to be a very difficult thing to find. I guess these are black books. Yeah, so uh, what spells do you think you'll find in the in, in, in a grimoire? Um, something to uh, uh, keep you safe from uh, devils, something to make somebody fall in love with you, something to give you wealth, something to give you power. Yeah, I think there are probably all sorts of spells in a grimoire. So, what about formality? Hmm, that's a good one. I think I'm probably going to give it a 6, 6.56. 6. I'm going to give it a 6 in formality. I think use it anywhere, although informally I might just say a book of spells or a book of magic. Um, and then as to origin, um, it comes from the French word grimoire, which is a variant of grammaire 
meaning a grammar book. And effectively, the grimoire is a grammar book of magic, yeah? It shows you what to do. We've got the Latin word grammatica, grammar or philology, yeah? From uh, grammaticos in ancient Greek, knowing your letters, yeah? From uh, grammar, something that's written, and uh, ikos as the thing. Yeah, grapheo, to write. So, a grimoire. Enough. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you soon. Bye for now. Grimoire.